Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sewing a patchwork puffer jacket. To make this jacket, I'm going to be using a bed sheet that I thrifted along with a tablecloth I thrifted and leftover fabric. For each of the front panels, I cut out 15 5 inch by 5 inch squares and I laid them out in the order that I wanted them. Then I sewed them together in columns. and I made sure to press the seams open. I then sewed the columns together, trying to line up the seams. Then the patchwork for one of the front panels was complete, and I repeated this process for the other front panel. Then both of the front panels patchwork were complete. I laid the front panel pattern piece on top of the patchwork and cut it out.
I also took a lining fabric and cut out the two front panel pieces. I then took the front panel lining and put it underneath the front panel patchwork piece. Then I sewed it at the sides, leaving one side open. Then I sewed horizontal rows. Then I took stuffing and very lightly stuffed to the front panel piece. I made sure not to fill up each of the rows very much or else it would be too puffy. Then I sewed the sides. Then both the front panel pieces are complete. Then I sew 24 squares together to make the patchwork for the back piece. Using the lining, I cut out the back piece. For the back piece, I did the same thing as I did for the front panel pieces, where I laid down the lining, then pinned the patchwork on top of it, then sewed ro rows and stuff. And for each of the sleeves, I sewed 24 squares together to make the patchwork. I 
and I did the same thing as I did for the other two, but just instead using the sleeve template. Then all the panels were complete. Then I sewed the back panel and the two front panels together at the shoulder seams. I sewed on the sleeves and sewed the side seams together. Then I flipped it inside out. Then I took a long strip of fabric and folded it in half, making sure to keep the corners nice by folding them inwards, and I sewed along the longer edge. Then I sewed the strip of fabric to the side of the front panel piece. Then I inserted the zipper. To make the neck piece, I folded a strip of fabric in half and sewed on the two short sides. Then I stuffed it and attached it to the neck edge of the shirt, making sure right sides together. Using a thrifted bed sheet, I made a lining using the pattern pieces I used for the rest of the jacket. I then put the lining on top of the jacket that I had so far, making sure the right sides were together. I pinned and sewed the neck edge. Then I pinned the lining to the sides of the puffer jacket.
Then I flipped the jacket right side out. Then I sewed the basting stitch around the bottom edge and cut off the excess fabric. Lastly, I attached bias tape to the bottom edge. Overall, I'm happy with the way this jacket turned out. If you like this video and like to see more like it, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you, bye.